Hallelujah, hallelujah. Greetings to you all, my followers, wherever you are watching me. May God bless you all, my retaining viewers. May God bless you in the name of Jesus. The Bible say, if God be for us, who can be against us? Hallelujah. Nobody. So it's nobody is but our brother, Dream Resolution TV. May God bless you wherever you are watching me. You are blessed for life in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise God. So today, again, I will have another meaning of a dream that we'll be talking about. So I will just throw some highlight on the, the various um, videos that I drop that was talking about that you have a dream and we've been surrounded by cows. Hallelujah. So it depends how you have a dream. Amen. So we, we, you were being hurt. Maybe you were being hurt by a cow in your dream. Maybe you were being attacked by a cow in a dream. Maybe you were being surrounded by a cow in a dream. So let me say there are other let me in each each of them, praise God. In each of them of the dreams that you have, it has their own meaning. Hallelujah. So they have their own meaning and it depends how you had the dream. Praise Jesus. So others have been people have been DM me on my messenger, struggling to ask um um, for me to explain to them, hallelujah, some on my WhatsApp, they have been struggling to ask and how um, well, you have a counter with such dream, what are you going to do or what is the meaning, hallelujah. So I align again about dreams and the meaning and the symbolism. So align some other dreams, amen, and their symbolism, praise God, hallelujah, praise Master Jesus. So, um, it is well, so please just keep on um, maybe dropping your, your comment at the comment section. You can still get me on WhatsApp or on Messenger. Hallelujah. So just write me and I will get back to you. Praise God. Hallelujah. So today we'll be talking on another topic that um, we're going to talk about. Hallelujah. So today we'll be talking on a topic that you had a dream and someone gave you a pen in your dream. Hallelujah. That someone gave you a pen in your dream. It can be a pen and it can be a pencil. Hallelujah. It can be a pen or it can be a pencil. But it depends. If it is a pen, it has another meaning. If it's a pencil, it has another meaning. Praise God. Hallelujah. So when we talk about a pen, so we say what is the symbolism of a pen? Hallelujah. So pen can symbolize a number of big ideas. Hallelujah. Pen can symbolize a number of big ideas. Amen. So it's talking about freedom. It's talking about intelligence. It's talking about creativity. It's talking about excuse. It's talking about determination. And it's talking about intelligence. Praise God. So pen can also symbolize the value or you have for your gift. Freedom of thought. Hallelujah. Freedom of thought. Amen. So, to receive a pen as a gift in a dream, you're talking about acquiring knowledge. Hallelujah. Acquiring knowledge. To receive pen in your dream signifies the transfer of authority, transfer of mandate, transfer of leadership, and also ownership in life, and also to be transferred as the next of king. So I just bring out just these um, um, at line on um, or if you have such dream like this, praise God. So we we'll go we we'll go on a detail about that this pen or pen was given to you in your dream. So now we are going now on the reinterpretation. So this one I just bring to just to add line, praise God. But we have another scriptural um, backings that will be. Use it as a precept on, on this very topic. So we have um, Psalms 45 from verse 1. Hallelujah. And we have Jeremiah chapter 17 verse 1. Jeremiah 36 and verse 18. Hallelujah. Praise Master Jesus. So if you have your time, so you can just go through um, the scriptures. Hallelujah. You can just go through the scriptures. Amen. So I will just read um, just Isaiah 45 from verse 1. It says, My heart is entitling a good matter. I speak in the things which I have made, touching the king. My tongue is the pen of a ready writer. Hallelujah. Praise God. You see, my tongue, hallelujah, is 
the pen of a ready writer. So um, it depends how you had um, the dream that someone gave you a pen. I don't know whether this person was still alive or this person is late. So this other, it can be someone that you know very well that gave you a pen in your dream. It can be a family member. It can be an auntie, an uncle, whosoever in your family that gave you a pen in your dream. Praise God. But we'll be talking on someone who is dead that what gave you have appeared in your dream in his image and he gave you a pen. Praise God. So now we are talking on the personality of the person. Hallelujah. It's talking about the personality of the person. Who was the person when he was still alive? Was he, um, let me say, a leader in a family? Was he a ruler in a family? Was he working in a government? Hallelujah. Was he a teacher? Was he the lawyer or a doctor? Whatsoever this person was doing. Amen. Praise God. But he, maybe he's not alive, but he appears and he gave you a pen in your dream. He's talking about the transfer of money. Hallelujah. It means that this person is transferring an ownership, a leadership. Praise God. Unto you. Hallelujah. So it, do, it does not depend on um, your age or your size. Hallelujah. But it's something that has been mandated from above. That leadership has to be transferred unto you. Other people have been having some similar dreams um, in that same manner. Praise God. But they never understand the meaning of it. Hallelujah. Some other people have been given maybe a plant. But something must be spoken. He must say something before handing this pen to you. Whether it's a pencil, the person must say something before handing this thing, the pen unto you. So it depends what he says when he handed this pen unto you. Praise God. Is it a plant that someone gave you in a dream? But they say what that must be said by this person before handing this thing to you. Hallelujah. Or giving as a gift in your dream. It has a meaning about there was there was something that he must say before handing that thing, either a pen or a pencil or whatever that he gave you, hallelujah, in your dream. So it symbolizes and it have a great meaning about it. Hallelujah. Praise God. So I'll be talking on that and on that various ones, like someone gave you a plant. Hallelujah. A peace plant whatsoever that he gave you. It can be a uh, steadily whatsoever that he gave you a fruit in your dream. But there is something that that person must say unto you before handing such thing or such gift in your dream. Hallelujah. So it signifies a great impact in the life of someone. Hallelujah. So that is the meaning of where you had such dream like this. That someone that you know, but the person is late, that gave you a pen. Hallelujah. In your dream. The person is not alive, but he gave you a pen in your dream. Praise God. So it has a very big meaning and very a great impact in your life. But you can be taking it um, like, say, just it's just many dream. No. Hallelujah. But it's something that has to manifest in you. Hallelujah. As you continue to grow up. Praise God. There's something that um, it will happen in your life. Praise God. If this person was a teacher or was either it was a mayor or was, I don't know. But he, that thing, the pen that he gave to you. No matter whatsoever, he need that you too must walk in a line in such um, things that he was doing on it. Hallelujah. He may, up, he may happen in another form. Praise God. But he is all about mandate, leadership, ownership, authority, next of king, um, freedom, acquire of knowledge, king, and it as a ruler. Hallelujah. So these signify mandate had been transferred unto you hallelujah praise god so please uh, may god bless you all if you have your dream don't hesitate please just drop your 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 explanation or just comment at the comment section or you can still go on my facebook and um, page you have my whatsapp number please just dm me or you can still write me on my messenger may god bless you stay blessed if God be for us, no one can be against you. Bye-bye. Stay blessed. See you next video.